bluefish is a very rich tasting fish that needs a strong sauce to go with it. With the Vietnamese caramel, the flavors balance each other out and it's just delicious. You can make the same recipe with pretty much any fish that has personality. I'm using a Vietnamese caramel, which just has fish sauce in it, soy sauce, and it has all these flavors that work well with this intense fish. That was fun. And also very necessary because you want to release all the flavors from the lemongrass, so you have to bruise it before you add it to the sauce. So this isn't actually a true caramel where you heat the sugar until it turns brown in the pan. This is a cheater's caramel, and I make it with brown sugar. I think it's just as good, or at least it's a heck of a lot easier. You want to let your sauce simmer for a few minutes to thicken before you add your fish. And then as soon as you add the fish to the pan, it's going to exude liquid and then the sauce is going to thin down a little bit and then you can use it to baste your fish. For a really thin filet, like a bluefish filet, you have the most control if you cook it on top of the stove in a pan because then you can really watch it and you know at the exact moment to flip it and the exact moment that it's done. The garnishes for this dish are really important because you want the fresh flavors of the cilantro and the scallions and the jalapeno to contrast with that very rich dark sauce so that everything balances out. 